Almost a quarter century after the project was first conceived, India has begun the production of its own light combat aircraft, LCA, named Tejas. The fighter jet gained final operational clearance, FOC, last month, the Indian Ministry of Defence announced on Monday. The Aeronautical Development Agency, ADA, handed over final operational clearance configuration documents to Hindustan Aeronautics Limited on December 31, 2018, which is duly cleared by the Centre of Military Airworthiness and Certification to go ahead with the production of final operational clearance fighter aircraft. Accordingly, HAL has taken up the production of LCA, Final Operational Clearance Fighter Aircraft, Subhash BAM, India's Minister of State for Defence said on 12 February 2019. The Indian Air Force, which urgently needs to maintain its present squadron strength, contracted with state-owned Hindustan Aeronautics Limited, HAL for the procurement of 20 initial operational clearance standard aircraft on March 31, 2006, the order was due to be completed by December 2011 and another contract for 20 FOX standard aircraft was signed on December 23, 2010, for fulfillment by December 2016. However, initial operational clearance was acquired by ADA only in December 2013 and so far, only 12 initial operational clearance of a consignment of 16 fighter aircraft have been delivered to IF. HAL plans to deliver the balance, for initial operational clearance fighter aircraft, by March, 2019. Earlier this month, Air Chief Marshal B.S. Dano, IAF Chief, had expressed displeasure over the slow rate of production of Tejas. We have been giving concessions to Hindustan Aeronautics Limited, HAL. But we will not get any concession from the adversary in war, Air Chief Marshal Danoa said on 31 January. Meanwhile, the Indian government has listed several steps that can boost the production rate of Tejas from the existing eight aircraft to 16 aircraft per year. HAL is establishing a second unit for structural and equipping activities. Currently, the IAF relies on a variety of Soviet era and Russian aircraft as well as some French Dassault Mirages and UK-slash-France Sipica Jaguar warplanes. A parliamentary panel on defence had suggested that a squadron strength of 42, 18-20 fighter jets in a squadron, would be needed to fight a two-front war with Pakistan and China simultaneously. However, the present scenario indicates that even if all existing orders for 36 refail jets, six squadrons of Tejas, including the Tejas Mark 1A, and two more squadrons of Su-30 MKI are taken into account, the squadron strength will remain below 30, even by the year 2032.